And our way go from the 1600 meter marker. Divas Express a little bit slow to go. Space Oddity, Karat, Hot Money. Kings meets crystals around them, conquer the world towards the inside. Then Golden Archer falling soft, the leaders rain wear. This point in time, Ruby slippers the grey as second to last. That's the first of the greys, and the second of the greys, Divas Express is your trailer. Karat with the orange headgear by three parts of a length from King's Meads Crystal moved up into second. Space Oddities in third. Hot Money's not far off the action. Fourth spot, the White Blaze. Then we have Conquer the World, Golden Archer, four and a half lengths off. Rain wears further back towards the inside as we go past the 800 zone. Ruby Slippers, Divas Express has eight to make up. Coming to the 600, Karat in front, trying to go all the way here. Karat by three parts from Kingsmead's Crystal second. Hot Money Space Oddity moves in towards the inside, conquer the world. Then comes Rain Wear. Homeward bound, 400 meters to go. Karat's down the center of the course. Space Oddity, Hot Money's going to come out. Rain Wear goes to the inside, conquer the world. Kingsmead's Crystal, the gray ruby slippers are starting to run on towards the outside. Karat at the 200 meter marker, Hot Money, Space Oddity, Rainwear's on the inside, Karat's digging down and Golden Archer's getting into it late on, Karat's now looking for the post and gonna just find it, from in second, Golden Archer, Hot Money and Ruby Slippers. Coming down to the winning post and number four. Karat continues to go for the Sagulims. Allison Wright and them. Keegan DeMello, Golden Archer, Hot Money, Ruby Slippers, Rainwear and Space Oddity. Three hundred meters out, Karat's down the centre of the course, continue to plug away. Hot money, golden archer, space oddity, rainwear, ruby slippers is on the outside, and golden archer is trying to get through, but Karat's in front and coming down to the winning post will stay on for the victory. Uh, well, Sheldon will keep us updated with regards to the race review or whatever the whatever is uh, taking place at the moment. Yeah, the race review. I haven't heard an objection, Hooter. So there's a race review in progress. Sheldon, let us know what the outcome is. But let's talk about Mkele Zono, who is the groom of Karat. He gets a thousand rand on behalf of Hollywood Bets and on behalf of Gold Circle. Well done to you, sir. Congratulations. Enjoy the cash. Thank you. Keegan, not for the first time today. Tell us about the race because Warren's horse, Golden Archer, was coming at you very quickly in the closing stages, but you did enough to hold on. Yeah, look, um, she got her, her nose down where it, where it matters. Um, she was always growing quite nicely. She quickened off the top of the lane, and if anything, she was just waiting for something to come to her, and uh, she would have probably kicked a little bit more. But uh, firstly, big. Thank you to Mr. and Mrs. Wright um, for, for the opportunities lately and to Mr. Sugulam, thank you very much for the opportunity as well. Very good third last time to a little bit naughty, so nice to see that she's come back to form. The, handy, the relief from the handicapper would have helped, but I'll talk to Alison about that in a moment. Yeah, she's now notched up her second win, and I think that Mr. Sugulam will have some fun with her. She's a type of horse that's always going to run well. Yes, yeah, she's, um, I think, at the right rating now, and uh, I think they will have a lot of fun with her. She's become a little bit more consistent, and... Uh, I think they found sort of the right trip 14 mile with her and uh, I'm just really grateful they ran her today. Um, could have easily taken her out, but just well done to the, well done to the team for, for keeping her in. Lovely. Hot seas in the last race. Maybe we'll talk again. Well done today so far, Keegan. Yeah, let's hope so. Just well done to the whole team again. Thank you very much for the opportunities. Allison's in the winner's area, not for the first time today. A nail-biting finish. You don't like those nail-biting finishes, do you? No, Warren, uh, after the race, previous race, uh, I didn't want to see another second. But uh... <laughs> Let's talk about uh, Karat, mm -hmm. and especially the relief given by the handicapper certainly would have helped this filly because we saw her go off form, and, and that was, you know, maybe when she was rated, you know, when she was rated in the high 70s. She's now come down in the rating. Certainly uh, has done well for her today. Yeah, Warren, firstly, just well done to uh, Rakesh. Um, 
he sent us this filly after she, you know, she, she won her races in Cape Town and she had a high merit rating and then was a bit disappointing. And uh, when she came to us, um, you know, she never showed us much in work and uh, we were scratching our heads and I think, you know, she has dropped down to where she's more competitive. We did think that she um, preferred the grass. Um, her runs on the grass for us were, had been better, but um, her, not a previous, the previous run on the poly wasn't too bad, you know. She was actually going to go to PE and then she sort of showed some light and ran a very good race last time out and uh, here we are in the winner's box, so thrilled. You know, Rakesh has been very patient with her, so thanks very much to him for the support. Well, well done to you and Kevin and the whole team. It's been a good day and travel home safely because you're done now. Yeah, thanks Warren and uh, to Keegan, well done. You know, he's riding fantastically at the moment and uh, um, to Cloverflow, Breda, thanks very much. You know, well done to them and to Hollywood Bets, our sponsors, thank you. And to our team at home, well done guys. Well done, Alison. Congratulations. It's been a good day for the team. Certainly has, and Karat's got it won. But keep an eye on Golden Archer, who's uh, running well now. This mare by Braveton Soldier, she was snapping away at the heels. And Golden Archer will be in the winner's enclosure soon. But it's not about Golden Archer now. It's about Karat now, the VAR filly. Well done to Clavenflay, Rajan Sagolem, and, uh, of course, uh, Keegan DeMillo. Alison Wright, your trainer. One more to come from Hollywood Bets, Gravel. We'll see you just now.